Hi everyone, welcome back to Nails by Mish. I'm sorry I've been on a bit of a hiatus, but I'm back and we're going to do 24 days of holiday nail art. So I'm starting off with G17 from the gel bottle. It's one of their glass colors. And I'm just going to apply nice thin even coats. And I just wanted to say thank you if you've tuned in to my old videos. I took, I think like a month and a half off to study because I work in insurance full time and I had an exam. So um, if you are tuning in again, thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. So I just applied my second coat of the green and now I'm going in with a cat eyes gel from this is from Amazon it's number 64 and just applying it evenly over the nail I, uh, I live in British Columbia where all of the mudslides are happening if anybody pays attention to the news um, my town was the one that got a lot of people got trapped in, but I was luckily at home. We took in someone and she stayed with us for two days and two nights and three days. It was really nice. Um, she was a complete stranger, like a friend of a friend. Um, but right now, just to get back to uh, what I'm doing here, I'm just kind of fiddling with the, um, with the magnet. I'm just kind of like pulling it back and forth across the nail to see if I can get more like glitter coverage essentially. And I wanted to show you the whole process because I, so I didn't edit any of it out. So I just kind of go back and forth and then I like using the little round end because sometimes it, it's like a little stronger. So it pulls a little more and I can get more glitter out. So right at the bottom there, I like the way that looks. Once I'm satisfied, I'll go and cure it. So next we're going to go in with a tiny dotting tool. doesn't matter the size. Use any size that you are comfortable with. And you want to do a dot for the middle, which is going to be your biggest dot. So you kind of want it to be a little bigger than the rest. So I'm kind of using the side of the dotting tool here. And you're going to go in and do two dots up, two dots down, and then two dots on either side. And then you're going to want to put one dot like in the corner of each. Yeah. Just like that. So the girl stayed with us. She was like a friend of a friend. She was really awesome. We enjoyed having her. Um, we had no power for a bit, no Wi Fi for a very long time. It was, it's been a time. And I've been enjoying the rain. And I'm going in with my Nail Queen 7mm. It's probably smaller than 7mm now. I trimmed it. But. Um, this is my 7mm liner brush, or I guess detail brush, and I'm just dragging from the middle out, dragging from the middle out on each of them and creating lines. And I just kind of wanted to fix this one. And honestly, that's it. That's why I called it a simple snowflake because it's just a series of dots and then just dragging your brush through it. So depending on the size of the brush that you have, you may have to adjust the size dots that you use. Um, if you have a thicker brush, you may want to use bigger dots. So that it may be a little bit bigger of a snowflake, but I'm feeling this like dainty look and my control with a brush has gotten a lot better. So I just wanted to do another one just because I thought it would look nice. This nail is quite large as opposed to usually I work on short natural nails. So this is like a treat. And just going in again, making all of those dots. It looks like a grid pattern. And then again, you just want to drag from the middle out. Drag from the middle straight down. 
turn it from the middle to the side and to the other side. And pull, yeah, on a diagonal outwards. Also, we saw a bear. A baby bear was in the tree outside of my house. If you follow me on Instagram, you can see photos of it. You would have. I don't have them up again. Maybe I'll make a little highlight of the baby bear. But he was captured and sent to a sanctuary. Now I'm just going to coat um, this nail in the Extreme Shine top coat. And I'm not sure if you noticed, but my Extreme Shine top coat has a spelling error. It says Extreme Shina top coat on the lid. But, um, oh. top coat just to seal everything in. Cure that for 60 seconds. And there it is. Simple snowflake nail art design. You don't have to do it with cat eyes. I did just to make it look a little extra. But if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Can, I'm going to list everything down below that I used as well. Thank you.